So we need to find the last digit of the number 2 to the 99th power. This number is so big that we cannot just look at the last digit using the calculator. We're also not expected to compute such a large number. If we don't know how to solve the problem with a large number, then check out smaller cases. Check out with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and probably the idea will come. This is always a very good strategy. So let's check out the last digit of the first few two powers that we can easily figure out. 2 to the first power is 2 with the last digit of obviously 2. 2 to the second power is 4 with the last digit of 4. 2 to the third power is 8 with the last digit of 8. And 2 to the fourth power is 16 with the last digit of 6. Continuing, 2 to the fifth power is 32 with the last digit of 2. 2 to the sixth power is 64 with the last digit of 4. 2 to the seventh power is 128 with the last digit of 8. Now there is not that many digits, right? We only have 10 different digits, 0 to 9, and all two powers are going to be even. So 1, 1, 3, 5, 7, and 9 are not options. So what's left is 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. And after a while, they start repeating. Let's just see this pattern. We have 2, 4, 8, 6. 2, 4, 8. Can we guess that the next one is going to be 6? We multiply the previous one by 2. We start here, right? 8 times 2 is 16. Write down the 6, carry the 1, but who cares in this particular case? We have a number and we double it. The last digit of the double will be completely determined by the last digit of the original number. We have this pattern of 2, then 4, then 8, then think 16, 6, and then back to 2. Right? So we have four different values, but they're, they come in a pattern. This is called an orbit. Now the question is much easier. The question is, where does 99 land in this? If we were to write out all these two powers or their last digit, where would 2 to the 99 land? Let's just figure about the exponents. 2 to the first power is 2. So when the exponent is 1, the last digit is 2. 2 to the second power is 4. 2 to the third power is 8. 2 to the fourth power is 16. Now 2 to the 5th power is 32. So it looks like we're just going to count and just sort of wrap the number line around this orbit of length of 4. So the question is where does 99 fall into this? Now the magic number here is 4. So if the exponent is 4 or 8 or 12 or 16 or otherwise divisible by 4, then the last digit is 6. That means that 100 falls here, right? 100 is divisible by 4, so the last digit of 2 to the 100th power would be 6. And 99 is just before that. So the last digit of 2 to the 99th power is 8. Thank you for watching.